MLB The Show's coverage of Major League now, Baseball is on the air. A good one on tap for you this afternoon between the Washington Nationals and the Atlanta Braves. Stepping into the box, Adam Eaton. He will lead this one off today. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Runs up and gets this one down. And he will smartly swipe that ball away in foul territory, so we likely won't see the bunt again now with two strikes. Just inside, not by much. It's 2 and 2. Forecast high calls for 80 degrees, but we're at 76 here at opening pitch. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is on to begin the inning. Standing in now, Trey Turner. Liner towards second. In there, a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Batting third, the left field, number 22, Juan. In now, Juan Soto. And that's ball three now as it just misses below the zone. Waiting on deck is Drupal Cabrera. And it's fouled away. He's set. Here's the three and two. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul, so a missed opportunity there. Freeman's got it, and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. So it's second and third with one gone now, and that'll bring in the switch hitting former All Star as Drubal Cabrera. One and two. One, two. Eaton on third. Turner is over at second with one down in the inning. Grounded back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. And the second run will score as that makes it a two-nothing ball game. That is it. The catcher, Jan Gomes. So now to the plate, Jan Gomes. Oh. Up high, two and one now. And there he goes towards second. He swings and misses. Throw down. He was right there for Darno to get his man. Here now the two-two. Started to go. Did he hold up in time? Yes, says the first base umpire. It's ball three now. Now the three and two pitch fouled away fouled off eighth pitch of the at bat coming up heading out towards shallow right Markek is coming on he's there to make the play and that'll retire the side Acuna digs in now. It'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Yo. Too much bite on the breaking ball that time as it's well off the outside. Belted high in the air out to left. Left fielder looking up to the track to the wall. And this one is gone. A home run. At the plate, Dansby Swanson. Swing and a screamer, but this one's not going to stay fair. The one-two. He's offered at and missed. He chased it for strike three. Here's the first baseman, That's Freddie good. Freeman. Pass the battles baseman. with Scherzer. He Freddie. has seven hits in 39 at-bats. Two of those hits were for home runs. Two balls and a strike to Freeman. Sitting in a good spot right here. Two ball, one strike count is yet to see a fastball. Have to be sitting on one right here. The 
2 2. Swing hard liner to left center. And Freeman's aboard. It's a base hit. At the plate now, Marcelo Zuna hit hard on the ground to short. And that gets through for a one out base hit. Into the box now, Nick Markakis on a line to shortstop. Stepping in for the Braves, Travis Darno. And now the Braves look to put more across the plate in this opening frame. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. Second inning set to go, and that'll give way to the third baseman, Carter Keeboom. The 1-1. One, one. Ball. He might still be thrown off from that first inning, guys. He got knocked around pretty good, and that can be hard to recover from mentally sometimes. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, it's gone. But it bends just foul into the second deck. Pulled high in the air out to left field. There to handle it is Ozuna, and there's one away. Striding in now for the Nats, Luis Garcia, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. The one-two. Bouncer up the middle. Swanson picks it up, and there are two away now. Digging in now, Victor Robles. He'll work on keeping this top of the second alive. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. And he fouls this one off. Bases are empty here with two men out. Swing and a miss at a big breaking ball, and that's how the inning comes to an end. Last half of the second set to go, and set to go is the third baseman, Austin Riley. Now a good slider that doesn't quite catch the zone. It's two and one now. Hit back toward the mound. And a base hit. So early trouble to lead off the inning. The second baseman, Ozzy. Ozzy. To the plate now, Ozzy Albies. Oh. Tries to change up on him there, but it's a ball two and one. Swing and a miss, two and two now. A runner at first with no outs here. And it's up to a three two full count now. A hey, struggling to find the release point of that curveball. That wasn't a very good one. Somehow he's just got to find that field because that's a pitch he's going to need going forward. And he misses there for ball four. So runners are at first and second now with nobody out. And he'll smartly just ensure that this stays a foul ball. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. And a bunt attempt here with two strikes that'll get foul, so he'll become out number one. The next to bat for Atlanta, Ronald Acuna, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. The last at bat, Nettie D. We heard this guy's a good fastball hitter. He got a fastball and didn't miss it. We'll see if they pitch him a little bit differently this time and mix in some off-speed pitches. In a big spot like this, you have to be looking for something you can handle. That Here's a fly ball well hit. Eaton going back. And goodbye. This one ain't coming back.
Stepping in now, Dansby Swanson. Still one and two as he fouls it away. Three runs already home here. Oh, and this is swung on and missed. Four strikeouts already, and that's out number two. Digging in to try it again, Freddie Freeman, the winner of last year's Silver Slugger Award for first baseman in the National League. And, whoa, awfully close, but it's ball four, according to Woody Keller. Here's Marcelo Zuna, a base hit in his first trip. The 1-1. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to one and two now. Two out with the man at first. And he strikes him out here, so he's able to stop the bleeding a bit as the side is retired. And now for Washington, Max Scherzer, 9-1-2 and two due up. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Throw to first in time, and the leadoff man is gone to start the third. One away now the Washington third, and the next Adam. to bat the speedy Adam Eaton. Third inning here, already 4-2 our score. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. On his way to second is Eaton. And he'll reach second now with one away. The so now to the plate, Trey Turner. Comes back with the cut fastball for strike three called, and there are two down. Juan Soto to the plate now. Runner in scoring position with two gone. And it's fouled away. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Grounded to short. Swanson scoops it up. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and that'll bring forth the veteran outfielder, Nick Markakis. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Swung on and hammered. No doubt about this one. Watch it fly. And that ball will stay fair, and it's gone. A home run. Standing in now, Travis Darno. And now a fastball, but he's able to hold off on it, and it's 2-1 and one now. Pretty good pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. Turner loves it on the first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. Now batted. Into the box, Austin Riley. One run in and one gone so far in this inning. The 1-2. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. So bases are empty here with two gone. And that'll bring up Ozzy Albies. Scherzer against the sign. Full count pitch on its way. Fouled away. The next 3-2. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. All set for the start of the fourth, and that'll bring in the switch hitting former All Star is Drubal Cabrera. Here's the one and one delivery, and right into the shift. Uh, this will get foul. It's a ball and two strikes. The one two. The ball hit out to Albies at second base. Reined in. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. So the base is empty here with one away. And that means the catcher, Jan Gomes, bats next. Down 
low. Two balls and a strike. Just off the end of the bat, it's a foul ball, and he'll stick around. The 2 2. Fouled off. Two runs, four hits, and no errors so far for the Nationals. And he looks at a sinker for a called third strike, and now there are two gone. Carter Keeboom digs in now. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. He likely had ball four that time, but couldn't hold back on the swing, so that moves the count to three and two now. This is skied into short left center. Acuna coming in. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth, and that'll bring up the pitcher, Josh Tomlin. And he fouls this one off. Here's another one, too. And he struck him out. Good pitch there as he registers his eighth punch out of the ball game. Back to the top of the order now. And that brings forward Ronald Acuna Jr. This guy's having a pretty good week so far in one game. It's last at bat his second home run of the game. We'll see if they'll pitch him a little bit more carefully in this A.B. That's a tough curveball right there to stay into as a lefty hitter. That ball looks like it's almost going to hit you, and it breaks over the inside half of the plate. Into the corner and slicing foul. One out, nobody on. Oh, he's really got the strikeout pitch working now as he notches number nine in the ball game. Dansby Swanson lining up to hit. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Full count, three and two. And whoa, awfully close, but it's ball four according to Woody Keller. So next up will be Freddie Freeman. It was a walk in his last trip. And he misses again. Ball four. And that's back-to-back -back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. Two men on. Two out. And that'll bring up the big RBI bat of Marcelo Zuna. 1-1. Is offered at and missed. He chased it for strike two. Hey, this is a big pitch right here. Can't allow them to tack on any more runs. Let's see if he attacks his owner. A swing and a miss. That retires the side. And that will do it. Ready to go in the top of the fifth. And that'll give way to the rookie second baseman, Luis Garcia. Here now the 2-2. Is laid off and the count runs full. Swing and a ball hit foul as this will find the seats in right. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Albies scoops it up, and no chance on the throw here as he reaches first easily. The center fielder, number 15. In now, Victor Robles. Line toward the gap in left center. Acuna is there, and he has it for the first out. So here now is the pitcher, Max Scherzer. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Here it comes on one and one. Popped him up. Swanson is there. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. So coming to the plate, Adam Eaton. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that one, his last at bat. But I got to think they're going to pitch him up, maybe elevate something in the zone. Interested to see how he approaches this next A.B. And another throw over. And he has to dive, but he's back in easily. 
We're in the fifth inning here. 5 2 is our score. Lifted in the air out to right. Marquecas has a read on it, makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. Here's Nick Marquecas now, the right fielder, and he'll lead things off against Max Scherzer. Yeah, that last at bat, Daddy, he turned that fastball around. He didn't hit it a ton, he didn't hit it a country mile, but hey, listen, a home run is a home run. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. Five runs, six hits, and no errors so far for Atlanta. This is line to left. And that'll get by and on through towards the wall. Throw into second. Kyle McGowan, a right-handed reliever, standing 6-3, gets the ball now out of the bullpen. Into the box, Austin Riley. A ball and two strikes. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. Now at the plate, Ozzy Albies. 0 for 1 with a run scored thus far. Ozzy. Ball and two strikes. Here it is. Reached for and popped into the air. Back behind second. Garcia has got it, and the side is retired. Chris Martin takes over to start the sixth now, inning on the mound. Number 55. Chris. All set for the start of the Martin. inning. And coming forward now is the shortstop, Trey Turner. Ready with the 1 1 pitch. Ball. Fastball just inside. Hey, this is a real pesky hitter right here. As a pitcher, you really like to keep this guy off the bases. This is a guy that kind of sets the tables for big innings. Tough pitch to lay off, but he did, and it's ball four, so the leadoff hitter is aboard to start the sixth. Here now is Juan Soto. No hits to this point. Takes a look at a changeup there, and it's a ball and two strikes now. Got to believe the pitcher's going to trust his defense right here. Look for something down in his zone to induce a ground ball double play. Popped him up. Darno over to his right, and that's the first out of the inning. So now next will be the four Don't hole for the Nationals as Dribble Cabrera is working on a one for two game so far. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. 5-2 is our score here in inning number six. Now Cabrera swings and misses on a good pitch that time as he's rung up for route number two. Now so it's a runner at first with two Yon. men out, and that Yon. means the catcher, Jan Gomes, bats next. And that's taken high for a ball. It's full now, three and two. 3-2, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. Runner back safely. And again a throw, yep. keeping particularly close tabs on him. He's set, here's the three and two. And it's fouled away. A payoff pitch one more time. Fly ball out toward left center field. Acuna's there for it. And that's the third out. Tyler Flowers is going to come off the bench as he'll be asked to lead off the bottom of inning number six. Tyler. 
And there's oh. ball two now. Unable to get the bat around in time, and the count evens at two and two. Swing and a miss got him reaching. And he makes the throw to first. Flowers is retired, and there's one away. Now that and here's Ronald Acuna Jr. now. He comes in two for three with a couple of home runs thus far on his line. The one two offering looked like a slider that time, but it's two and two. And a wave and a miss on a ball that was way out of the strike zone. There are two away now. And next will be Dansby Swanson digging in. Will attempt to put the ball in play for a change here with the first two guys going down on strikes to start the inning. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as the side is retired. Darren O'Day is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 56. Stepping up now, Carter Keeble. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. Here's the 2 1. A high fastball is in there. Two balls, two strikes, a crucial count for both pitcher and hitter. So, Dan, what was your approach on the mound in that count? Do you still pitch for the strikeout here? Action pitch right here, 2 2. The last thing you want to do is to fall behind the count, 3 2. Luis Garcia is on deck. Crowd gets up for the 3 2. Swing and a liner. Foul. The next 3 2. And a good take there as they'll have a leadoff man aboard to start the seventh. It's ball four. Now batting. At the plate, Luis Garcia. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. And he lays off there, ball four. So back to back walks have him in business here with nobody out. So it's first and second now. Nobody out. And that'll bring up the outfielder, Victor Robles. Boy, the Nationals could use a big hit right here. They really haven't been able to do much all game long. This would be a great time to get something going. He'll try it again, three and two. 5-2 our score as we play inning number seven. And that misses. Ball four. And he's going to need to settle down in a hurry now because he's in a peck of trouble. Brock Holt will come on to pinch hit here in a big spot. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. Fouled away. Liner towards second. But well, this is hauled in by the second baseman. So they'll go to the bullpen now, and it'll be the left-hander here to face the upcoming left-handed batter. Adam Eaton will be the first to meet him here, and he'll do so in an enviable situation indeed. Bases loaded and only one out now. 1-1. It often becomes harder to hit the zone when the pressure starts to heat up. Hit in the air to straightaway center. Acuna's there for it. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And a relay to the plate. And they'll get one back with the sack fly as it's now a 5-3 to three ball game. Stepping in and ready for another shot. Trey Turner. Two outs and two runners aboard here in the seventh inning.
And the count will be full. Now a swing, and he gets him to pop it up. Will this be a big out out of the bullpen? Albies put this one away, and the side is retired. Tanner Rainey gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Number 21. Tanner. Striding in, Freddie Freeman. It was a walk in his last trip. Swing and a hard liner to center field. Robles is right there, one down. And now the Atlanta number four hitter, Marcelo Zuna. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. Two and two to Marcelo Zuna. Come on, Bray. Come on. And he struck out again. That's the third time he's gone down on strikes in this one. Now back. Into the box no now, you. Nick Markakis. Yeah. He's got a hit in three at-bats right to this there. point. Here's the one-and-one one pitch. Two out, nobody on. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. Again, a one-two. This is a fun guy to watch when he's up there, really battles. Doesn't take any pitches off, he's a grinder. Always seems to make it difficult on the opposing pitcher. Early swing there as he pulls it foul to the right side. Still two and two. Popped up. And this is going to fall. He can't flag it down. You know, taking you inside the mind of a batter right here, you can't get in auto swing mode. You still have to control the strike zone. Fouled off. And now this will be the tenth pitch of the at-bat. And this will miss down okay. low in the dirt, so he's worked it full now at three and two. Hey, this guy's a hard guy to put away. He's fouling off some tough pitches. Two-two two count. And he just seems to keep hanging right in there. And this misses to Marcakis. It's now ball four. Line to the right side. And that'll get by and on through towards the wall. Marcakis ignores his coach. He's chugging for home. He scores as they extend their lead to three. Up next for Adela, the third baseman, Austin Riley. At the plate now, Austin Riley. Hit back up the middle. Fielded cleanly. Ah, but the throw will be well late. So a good play, but it's off or not, as that'll be an infield single. The batter, number one, second baseman. Stepping in now, Ozzy Albies. Oh, the target, but this is low, two and one. Has to be a challenge pitch coming up here. He probably doesn't want to flirt with loading the bases. Off-speed pitch misses here, and he runs it to three and one. Somebody's getting frustrated. He's not used to getting hit around like this. Just does manage to get a piece there as this is bounced foul. Started to go around, but it's a called third strike anyway, and that will retire the side. Shane Green will come on now, and he'll slide into the seven spot in the lineup following the double switch. Adam Duvall will also come on now as he'll move into the pitcher's number nine hold in the order here on that double switch. Number 23, Adam. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One -one. Fastball just missed above the zone. Three balls and a strike to the Nationals left fielder. 
If you're at the plate in this situation, you're only thinking one thing, and that is get on base. You got three balls. Ball it has four. to be perfect over those 17 inches for you to pull a trigger. A walk is as good as a knock right here. The one two is swung on and missed strike three. Here's the catcher, Jan Gomes. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Working for the punch out and the offering. And he fouls this one off. Oh, a fastball swung on and missed. And for the second time today, he's gone on strikes. Number now eight. in the box, Carter Keeboom. He's 0 for 2 with a walk thus far. There's a oh. shin high slider laid off for a ball. Oh. And there's ball three on a breaking ball that misses ball. away. Well, tying run on deck. He should get something really good to hit right here in a three wood. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Acuna going back, but he can't get to this one. It's off the wall. Now the relay home, and he will score ahead of the play, and that'll close the gap to two. It's six to four now. So now to the plate, Luis Garcia hit sharply on the ground. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. He's in at second safely as they also push across a score to make it a one run game. At the plate, Victor Robles. That misses. Two and one the count now to the national center fielder. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. Trying to hold the lead. Here's the delivery. Two out here and a runner at second. And it's fouled away. Fouled off. Two and two. Here it is. And he misses with that one down and in. It's a full count now. Three and two. For the guy on the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes easy. He's thrown a bunch of pitches and got him looking. And that'll do it. The inning is over. Ryan Harper will come on to pitch now as he'll move into the eighth spot in the lineup on the double switch here. Michael Taylor is into the ball game as well as he'll slide into the pitcher's spot, hitting ninth now on the double switch. Number three, Michael A. Taylor. Ready with the two and two. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Taylor is there. One down. One away for the Braves here in inning number eight. And that'll bring up the always dangerous Ronald Acuna Jr. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Where this one almost in the books, the story was clearly the long ball. What are your thoughts on this offense, fellas? Well, Manny V, I don't know what your thoughts are, Dero, but boy, when the weather starts to warm up and the ball starts jumping out like this, it's clear that the pitchers need to start making better pitches. Yeah, just great approach. No one really chased today. Really stayed staunch on, uh, on their ability to get that pitcher to come into the heart of the plate, and they did damage with it. The 2-2 two -two one more time. A bouncer up the middle. Turner fields it cleanly, and there's out number two. Now with the play, Dansby Swanson. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. The 1-1. One, one. 
is in off the plate. A hey, curveball that kind of backed up on him right there. Might have popped out of his hand just a little bit earlier than he intended. Hit hard to third. He's got it. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Mark Melanson takes the ball now in inning number nine, looking to close the door. Digging in, Michael Taylor. He'll lead things off against Melanson as they're down to their final three outs. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Now a bunt attempt here, but a foul ball, one and two now. Now the pitch. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Acuna's there for it. And that's the first out of the inning. Now back to the top of the lineup, stepping in, Adam Eaton. He's two for three and looking for more here. Line drive to left. So he'll add one to his total as that falls in. He's got three hits in this one. To the plate now, Trey Turner. Two and one to count to Trey Turner. Runner at first here, one man out. Skied into very shallow right. Marcakis has a read on it. Two down. So striding in, one Soto. They'll be looking for something he could drive into the gap and drive home that time run from first. The 2 1 home. And with about 32,000 in the building, they're on their feet now. Now a swing and a fly ball. And this should do it. And that's in there. Base hit. Now batter. The first base hit. As Drupal Cabrera. Standing in now. As Drupal Cabrera. And that misses. Two and one. Popped him up. Darno waits on it. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Well, it's getting more and more common in baseball now these days to use a ton of pitchers to get through a game, and it took six here to get the job done, but, hey, they'll do whatever they can to get a W. A one-run game, 6-5 to five, the final today. The Braves took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Josh Tomlin is the winning pitcher of record. Max Scherzer takes the loss despite striking out 11 batters. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. The final line score for our ball game this afternoon for the victorious Atlanta Braves. Six runs, nine hits. No errors. They left eight men on base. For the Nationals, five runs on nine hits. No errors. They left eight men on base. The winning pitcher is Josh Tomlin. The loss goes to Max Scherzer. Time of the ball game, three hours and 34 minutes. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of the Braves and everyone at Truist Park, we'd like to thank you for attending and remind you to please drive home safely. Thank you.